so in this video we will see how you can use alerts in your app alert is basically used to provide any type of warning any type of in information in a pop-up so it will be very useful in a real life scenario so we are going to see how you can implement uh, alert in your app so first of all create a react native project and open it in the visual studio code i have already created one and i already opened the ios simulator you can also run it on the android simulator and use npm start to run this okay so uh, we'll be creating a small app in which user can type their name and enter the age and uh, after uh, pressing the button the app will going to tell you that if you are uh, eligible to drink or not okay based on your age so let us first create the uh, uh, variables that we are going to use we are going to use hooks use state for dynamic content name mm. we actually don't need to create name because we are not going to store it we only need an age so const let's set it to zero okay so first of all create two input box we have seen in our earlier videos how to use uh, input box first of all we need to import text input let's supply some styling we have created a uh, another file for style sheet let's name it input let's apply the background color let's uh, yellow padding of 20 more of it of 2 As you can see, this is our input box, text input you can say. Okay, we need another one for the age. Let me also apply margin top. let us also create a button button is already declared okay so can i drink okay 
so let me just first save the uh, whatever uh, age uh, user uh, is going to input in the second box into this variable and change text we'll be getting the text from this component now we will set it this test h okay now on the button press it will fire a function let's say edge handler and this and edge handler uh, will decide if user can drink or not so let us create that function if g is greater than let's set 21 then user uh, can allow to drink okay so you uh, you need to first of all import the alert from react native just like alert dot alert now you need to provide two things first of all the headings um, if age is above 21 then you can drink user can drink so let's say you can drink or else okay so what i have done here first of all user enter their name and the age and when user and when i enter the age uh, in this uh, text input then this age, the whatever uh, age user enter will be stay stored in this age uh, variable then when i click on this button it will pass the action to this age handler and if age uh, is uh, greater than 21 then an alert will pop up that you can drink and if it's less than 21 then alert will pop up that sorry you cannot drink so let us see if this works let's say 24 as you can see it works perfectly yeah you can drink let me just enter age below 21 let's say 19 it says sorry you cannot so this is a small application that demonstrate how you can use alerts there are uh, various uh, methods you can also use with alerts we will see those in our next video so thanks for watching